guys welcome to today's video I am quite excited today because we are going to be trying out the LA Girl Nudes eyeshadow collection as you guys can see I haven't touched it yet um, but a lot of pe people have said that <laughs> is everything gonna fall out now okay so everybody has said that this is kind of a dupe for one of the naked um, eyeshadow palettes which I don't know and I'm not going to compare that today I'm going to do some swatches we're going to do some neutral eye look and just see how it performs so if you guys want to see what this does stay tuned okay guys so going into this uh, video this is the palette is quite nice it's laid out exactly like the naked palette um, I only see three matte shades which are these three a white uh, like a pinkish brown tone and then a more like caramel brown and these are all shimmers so the brush you get in here is this little thingy which is quite cute but thus will not be used okay so let's get into swatching some shades now this palette does come with a little mirror at the top which is very cute um, it's very small but it's very cute and um, so yeah let's swatch some shades and see these shades obviously have uh, no name so I'm just gonna start from the lightest shade and go through so this is the white shade oh that's quite soft you I don't know if you guys can pick it up on the camera but it's very soft and then we have this pink wow it actually looks hard when you look at it but it, it's actually so soft like the shades when you touch them wow that's a beautiful shade guys i love it. it's almost like a cool tone pink color wow sorry guys the doors open so if you hear like kids crying and whatever not i'm sorry but it's too hot okay so then we're moving on to the third shade the third and the fourth shade which is first a shimmer and wow that's not bad at all i wonder how they're gonna perform jeez that's actually beautiful wow can you guys see okay now we're going into that darker matte shade which is like a chocolatey brown color and we're gonna swatch that geez these are so beautiful they look very soft eh? I didn't expect that okay sorry guys I don't even I don't even know what to say but anyway okay so then moving on to the next shimmer shade which is this fifth one so now we're just going into shimmer shades this is the one I'm going to do now and then I'm just going to go up so this is also a lightish kind of um, shimmer shade these colors are very beautiful guys I must admit for the price I think this palette was like 99 Rand or something ridiculous like that okay so now we're going into a more like darker Oh, this is beautiful, like a cool tone purple shimmer shade. Holy shit balls, this is freaking beautiful, really? Wow, okay, now we're going into, so that's more of a, like a rose, the rose gold tone. Now we're going into like a more gold kind of color. I cannot believe how freaking pigmented this is I thought it was gonna be like a sorry LA girl I thought it was gonna be like a chalky type of thing because when you open the palette at first it looks a bit hard and you know not very impressive but whoa now I'm gonna go into this chocolatey shade or brown these are so soft guys holy crap guys can you guys see how pigmented that is? And now there's another pinky shade. Guys, really? Oh my goodness. 
I don't even know what to say. Then there's another chocolatey shimmer shade. Wow. This is more of a cool toned one and then this is more of a warm toned one. I'm just clean my hand. Then there's two more shades which are like a blackish shimmer shade and a grey one. So the last two in the palette. Oh, it's so soft. I don't have any more space almost. Okay. Holy crap, guys. Okay, this is not black. It's like a very, very dark brown. And it almost like, it's like a buttery shat shatin. <laughs> satiny kind of um, shade. It's not overly like uh, shiny and stuff. And then here's like a grayish color. Oh, it's not gray. It's also brown. Okay, so this is like an all brown neutral palette. Can you guys see how beautiful those shades are? I am very... I was always like keeping this palette to the side and I was like... Mm. And then I saw um, Mercedes Marshall uh, do a comparison video. I'm sure you guys know her, but if you don't, I'll put a link down below. She's... I love her video. She's so quirky. And yeah, so then I thought, okay, well, let me do it. Let me try it. And <laughs> I actually got this palette for free. I think they had a special where if you buy 250 Rand or more, you get this palette for free. But when you want to buy it, it's 99 Rand or something ridiculous. And I freaking love this. I really do. So it's a very, very affordable everyday palette. Holy crap, guys. I'm actually excited to do a look now. But before we jump into the look, if you guys are new here, I upload three times a week and I play around with makeup and we just have fun together and see what we come up with. So subscribe and like this video. Comment down below if you want to see anything. And yeah, let's get started on the eyes. So there aren't many uh, matte shades, but... I've already set my eyes, but I am going to just take this white shade on the side and just run that over my entire eyelid. Just to like brighten it up a bit. And yeah. And then I'm going to go in to that light pinkish shade and just work that above my eye flapper my eye flaps yeah because if I put something in my crease you're not gonna see it because my eyes are very hooded so as you guys can see I put it like right on top of that creased area oh, it's beautiful soft colors they Obviously, this is a light matte color. It's not overly pigmented, but it's beautiful and so natural and it blends so beautifully. Can you guys see? So you can build it up like I'm doing right, right now. So I'm just going to take that lighter sh shade and pack that on in the top. Okay, so that is that one shade. Let me just tie my hair back, make it easier for me. Now I'm going to take a little bit of a darker shade and I'm just going to work that into my outer corner just to create some depth there. So the matte shades aren't overly pigmented. Um, it's a darker shade. Okay, I'm not going to tap off the excess. I'm just going to try and pack that in and then blend. It is very natural and beautiful actually. Can you guys see? And then I'm just blending it into the let the just 
just doing very natural makeup today. Nothing outrageous. So this palette is definitely for someone for like an everyday palette. I'm literally just going to take this little brush that I got in there and take that brown and just like do the bottom of my lash line and smoke it out a bit. This little brush is not too bad actually. And then I'm going to just take some and put it on the top there just to blend it in. There we go. Looking very nice. Okay, so now I'm just going to take that pinky shade again and just soften up here on the top a bit. Okay, and now this is where we are at. Now I don't know what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to take this color here and take my finger and just pat it on the inside of my eyelid. Oh, that's very nice. I wonder if I spray it also if it gets a little bit more intense. So let's try that. Let's try that. Spray and then going in there. Ooh. Okay. Oh, it does actually help. It's not like a overly like, holy crap, like a. Oh. It's not like a overly shiny, like wow, show stopping vibes, you know, but it is beautiful for every day. I'm obviously doing more of a pinkish brown look. There is a gold in there. So if you want to go with gold, you can do that. Now I'm just going to see if I take my finger after I've put on the... Oh, yeah, okay. After I've put on with my, with my brush being wet and then I go in with my finger, the color actually builds up beautifully. Can you guys see? So scrap what I said. It can be built up and it's beautiful. Wow, holy crap! I actually wanted to give this palette away, but now I'm not a freaking owl going to. Can you guys see? It's so pretty. Okay, what I'm gonna do now is take a more precise blending brush, like a little tiny with a tawny head. And I'm going to see if I go into that chocolatey brown shade third from the corner if I can just build it up a little bit and how dark the darkest shade goes. Because I'm this is not even the the darkest shade. Okay, let's go with that one second from the corner. Okay, yes. So you can do this and build it up in the corner. There's a little bit of fallout, but nothing to to cry about so you can take this to a, like a smokyish type of vibe as well I'm just going to take that other softer brush and blend it in there because it's so beautiful I know I'm packing it on packing it on I'm just gonna take the same of that same shade from second from the side and just intensify my corner of my bottom lash line a bit and I then I'm gonna leave it there I'm not going to Then what are we going to use for our inner corner? Let's see. Let me wet my brush. 
let's see that first that third shade if we can put pop pop that on oh wow okay we can pop it on the top Jeez, this was supposed to be like an everyday look now we're going into like a mauvey kind of smoky freaking situation here and I'm kind of liking it and in a corner vibes same color wow. I like wow guys guys this is kind of like blowing my mind at the moment like freaking hell okay so I'm going to call it I'm gonna call it that's the end of that and then I'm gonna put my some mascara on and do the rest of my face quickly this is what my eyes are looking like and then we can have a chat about what I think about the palette so I'm back and I've put on the rest of my face and guys I'm well let me see I'm actually using the pink cosmetics I think this is their lip lusters and peony blush and I'm actually loving the shininess with this eye but anyway going back to the palette this is freaking amazing this is the nudes palette so if you guys are looking for something to start out with if you're just starting out in with makeup this is definitely something to have it's got like your pinky shades brown there's a gold there's so much that you can do with this palette i know it doesn't look impressive but as soon as you start digging in i was so freaking surprised guys so yeah i would give this palette about an eight out of eight to nine out of ten I haven't used any of the um, Urban Decay palettes, the Naked palettes, but this is good for me. This is like, I've tried a lot of drugstore palettes and this is freaking beautiful for 99 Rand. It's ridiculous. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I know I say that all the time, so you better do it now. Like, now. <laughs> okay, guys. Well, thank you guys so much for watching and yeah, subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you next time. Bye.